Hello, welcome back to the channel. I have additional information about the nuclear product that was found in Broken Arrow. <clears throat> thorium-232 is a kind of offshoot of thorium. It's a natural byproduct and it has a half-life of 14 billion years, people. Okay, so what that means to you is that it's going to be as strongly radioactive as it is for 14 billion years and then it will break down to being half as powerful. Bad, bad news for you Broken Arrow and <clears throat> a reason for you to want to leave the area. Also, Thorium-232 was being experimented as a fuel for a nuclear reactor that as of this year no one has used it commercially because it, it breaks down in a way that is not as efficient as what is normally used, which is uranium. So probably what happened is someone was experimenting with it somewhere, uh, and this is the leftovers from that experiment, and probably a contractor bid on getting rid of it, that's normally how the government does it. Now, if it was a private entity, it could be a whole different process. But if you win the contract, then you do something with that waste. And it could have been a company, could have been an individual. It doesn't matter. What they did is purchase land. I have no idea how long Broken Arrow has been there, but the name implies that this person may have known it, this was a byproduct of some sort of nuclear accident um, and then purchased the property and buried it and didn't bury it deep enough for something that's as strong as thorium-232 seems to be I would think a safe burial would be like 30 to 50 feet underground or more and it's one thing to think about if you are buying land somewhere was there a, a plant? Was there a biological experimentation business? Was there a mine near a, a mine that was active and then shut down? Because uh, used mine shafts are a good place to dump stuff like this because it's going to go so far underground, you're not going to expect it to affect what's above ground. So Broken Arrow folks, you guys need to just scoot boot if you can. Uh, the land values and uh, everything in your town are going to plummet when the news of this gets out. So you've got a very short window to get away from that stuff now um, before you won't be able to sell any property there. All right, you guys, keep your eyes open. Caveat mTOR, be a smart purchases purchaser wherever you are of whatever you're buying all right bless you shalom